like your parents and stuff. Okay. So we're going to play a game. Or I'm going to time you for 20 seconds, and I want you to go into my home and find five of the most, or as many, of the most random objects you can possibly get your hands on. Okay, 20 seconds? That's not a lot of time. Yeah, well... Sure, you can give me, like, 30 seconds? Okay, fine. I'll give you 30 seconds. Let me attempt to pull no, up no, a timer. No, just look here. Okay. L on the computer. Okay. Get ready. Get set. Go! You should see her running around scooping things up. <laughs> 20 seconds. How many do I have to find? Five things of the most random... randomness. Okay. <laughs> she came back a little bit early, about five <laughs> seconds early. Place your objects here. Okay, the things that we found was... This thing, <laughs> which is half of a container my mom found at Bed Bath & Beyond, used to hold um, onions in the fridge. Hmm. Only half of it, though. I don't even know. Um, then there's this squirrel, <laughs> which is a dog toy. Oh, give me that. Oh, the dog's here. Go get it. Then there's this candle, which is never supposed to leave the mantle, but she oh. moved it anyway. Oh, I'll bring it back. This is the Lord of the Rings PlayStation 2 game. And the... Ah... Uh, Remote control for the television. <laughs> Stop dominating my dog. <laughs> I just really love dogs, man. <laughs> He's so sexy. So that's, <laughs> that's what Maisie does under pressure. I think he just grabbed the five most in-your-face items that there were. Like, just, oh, item, item, item. Well, it was... The stuff that was laying on the floor. Ah. <laughs> Great. Okay. So I have to go again? Um, no, but I need you to go get me that melon. Ow! I told you I didn't want it! You're not going to eat it! We can do it! I'm going to explain what I think of it. And bring the jello, too! I'm just making her bring the jello because she hit me. And I'm angry. Bring me the jellin, jello, the melon. Thank you. Do you want an eating utensil for your strawberry jello, ma'am? This is strawberry jello, which Maisie <laughs> destroyed. No, you helped! And. Excuse me. This is the melon. See, I think this tastes like nail polish remover. I changed my mind. I do. I do think it does. Smell it. <laughs> now eat it. <laughs> oh, come on! No! It's still on your bed. I'll, I'll, here. Oh, I can't believe you threw that back in there. Give me that. Okay. Let the record show that <laughs> even when I tell her that it's going to taste like nail polish remover, <laughs> she still eats it. It does taste pretty bad. I grew up a healthy child eating fruits and vegetables and like someone who hates tomatoes. Moron. Hate tomatoes. They're delicious. I like yeah, this yeah, slice it up real thin and put salt on me with fork. I'm glad spoon. I asked you if you wanted an eating utensil and you didn't say anything. I'm saying yes. <laughs> <laughs> you got melon juice on me! Yeah. I dropped Why the jello I and I can't know. find it. I'm your guest. <laughs> Jeez. Stupid peppy. Anyway. Okay. Well, I have something really important to say, and now I can't think of it. So I'm just going to do this. What was it about? What were you going to tell me earlier? Oh, my God. What was it? Remember? You said you had something really important to tell me. What was it? Um. You get gel in here. Let's see. What were you going to say? Remember? I told you to write it down, and you said, okay. Remember? Edge again. Yeah. She doesn't like the edge part. She only eats the center, but we mix it up. You know those up. edge pieces where they're like, like they're more solid and they're rubbery? I don't like them. I burned my palate, so now I'm taking the skin off of it. It's like being weird. I don't know.
What were you, you know see? what movie I'd recommend? Monsters and Aliens. I just watched that. That's hilarious. We just, we love that. Except when we paused it and didn't watch it for like half an hour. So basically, overall, this video is me eating Jello. And it's sugar free. Yeah, because she's on a diet. Yes, I am. For no reason. Jello. Jell is the reason you're on a diet. Today we were in the local shopping store and we were gonna That's go funny. over to the clothing section for women and she didn't want to go over there the reason being she thinks she looked too good because she's no. so skinny that's not what I said it's not what I said I don't want to go over there because nothing fits me I'm too small actually even the small doesn't fit me that's too small shut up <laughs> everything she's so mad at me why don't you just get skinny and stop being mad at me? She's convinced that she's too skinny, and you know what? She's I fine. I am. I weigh like 110. I lose weight every time I come over to your house. I lose like five pounds every time I get on your scale. I've lost weight. You know what? Please stand up. Okay. Come here. Hold up your. Hold up this. <laughs> okay. I'm sorry. My hands <laughs> are cold. Don't touch me. I'm sorry. Okay. Observe. I'm not going to touch don't. you. I don't want you near me. Okay. Okay. See this? Maisie! Okay. Shut up, Peppy. There's this little <laughs> section of fat right there. Okay? It's a little bit of pudge. This bit of pudge signifies that she is, in fact, not too skinny. She's perfect. But she reviews it. over my belt. Yeah, because you're fat. Shut your mouth! I'm working on it! And today she mm, wouldn't go into the clothing hot. section mm. because she she thinks everything's just going to look so good on her. No, that's not the reason. Yeah, it is. Okay, I didn't want you to feel that because I'm skinny. Is that it? Is that what you wanted to hear? No, I wanted you to hear that... I wanted everyone to know just how stuck up about yourself you are. <laughs> I'm not stuck up. I hate myself. I do, and you know it. I'm going to keep eating this jello and making fun of her pudge. I love you. I love your pet.